Gamers, gather round. It is your boy, Chief Keef, motherfucking Deef. Goddamn, goddamn. Well, obviously, being the leader of our society in Head Gamer 67 42 12 97 is my gamer tag. Hit me up. There has been a lot of talk recently about male gamers. Now, obviously, males and, you know, men, anything with a penis is generally just disgusting. You know, they're the worst. They're like cannon fodder. They're basically the rats of society. You know what I mean? You've got pigeons, what are the rats of the sky? Men are the rats of the humans. And the hu girls and women, they love pointing it out and reminding us. Now, obviously, when you play Call of Duty and someone kills you, you probably call them a fat weeb or something, don't you? It's fair game. You know, you take it, you give it, you probably cry, you make other people cry. It balances out like Thanos, you know what I mean? Perfectly balanced. The problem is, ladies are starting to take things personally. Now, obviously, there's certain things you shouldn't joke about, and we'll go into that later down the line in this clip I'm going to show you. But this woman here is absolutely made me scratch my nuts and call me Freddy because I, I'm completely confused who I am anymore. Male gamers treat male gamers exactly how they treat women gamers, and then women are now saying that, oh, uh, well, they're being misogynistic so they don't want us to play the game. Bro, they don't want anyone to play the games. They don't want to play against them. anyone. You know what I mean? Like, if you've got a 360 no scope, I'm calling you a fat pig. It looks like Gandhi's flip-flop after it's been left out in the sun for 12 years. Like, you're going to get some horrible comments from me. It's part of gaming, bro. You're going to call me a fat dweeb as well. It's just life. It's cycle. It's perfectly... It's just perfect. Why change it? And now woke women are getting all sad and... Ugh. You know, the ones who go on Twitch and get their breasts out so people subscribe and send them money. Them one. Yeah, you know them. Last 10 minutes in a COD lobby is not, nor has it ever been, a valid excuse for men to act like pieces of human garbage in gaming. I shouldn't have to play a game where all I say is hi and the whole game is thrown and I'm in hell for the next 40 minutes because men are being emotional about it. See, that is a valid point. I'll give her that. You know, I have had it before. You know, when you're young, you see here a girl say, Holy shit, you a woman! I've never spoken to a woman. Tell me. Please keep talking. And then you're muted and you're blocked. The beauty of gaming is you can block people. You don't have to speak to them. You know what I mean? The same way, in, you know, if you don't want to speak to someone who's talking to you, you could just walk away. You could just block them. Literally, usually, like, right-click or, you know, go down, click square or something. Mute. That's all, that's all you have to do. Mute. <laughs> that's it. You don't have to sit there and, you know, talk. You don't have to. And yeah, I get that saying hi in a lobby sometimes can be a bit scary for girls and you know me personally i'm always scared of saying hi in a lobby because you know i get taken the piss out of because i'm you know a white male these days you know you just it's so hard I'm just, a white heterosexual male is just so tough being in society <laughs> but it's fine though because i've got through it just like this lady has to that is not normal and that's not how the old cod days were because i promise you as a man you have never had somebody throw on the basis of your gender that doesn't happen you can say it happens you're lying. I'm sorry. I don't know why that's such a common thing in the comments of my videos. You guys want to be oppressed so bad that you'll look at a man calling me a telling me he's going to tell me to get back in the kitchen and say it's not a woman thing. See, they, that's just, yeah, the rape one's bad, but getting getting back in the, you know, kitchen is just a funny joke. You know what I mean? It's like it's like telling a ginger person to get back in the biscuit. To, you know what I mean? It's just it's a little bit of banter. Like, no one's actually, well, I'm sure there are quite a few people who are serious. If someone said, oh, the, like, get back in the kitchen, you wench. You know, I wouldn't take it too personally. You know what I mean? There's some nasty people out there, and then there's some humorous people out there who are just after a bit of a laugh. The best thing you can do is just get involved. You know what I mean? Give it give it back and i know oh i don't want to i want to just play in peace humans are toxic bro we are a nasty group of individuals and gamers are far far worse than the average human so if you're playing call of duty and expecting to have a nice pacifist day where no one's calling you a fat ugly loser then i'm sorry bro you need to go play roblox or something even then you'll get a six-year-old calling you to get back in the kitchen there's no safe space in gaming and say that that happens to you too it doesn't there's a reason that historically Male dominated spaces are known for being toxic and unsafe. That goes for gaming, that goes for sports. Any male dominated space is a bad one. That's not me being sexist. That is me saying there is an inherent issue with the way that you guys have your locker room talk that makes everybody else feel unsafe. I don't. The same valid point. I will accept that. You know, there is this sort of laddie culture, isn't there, in gaming? It's like locker room talk. You're not invited. It's men only, you know, in the man cave sort of shit. But girls have the exact same thing. You know what I mean? You can't just pretend that these women don't have their own little groups and community. You know what I mean? Like, it's not like that. It's not like men have their own thing and women are left out. Women have their own little circle. Men have their own circle. Gaming is predominantly male. You know what I mean? And, you know, I'd say maybe 30-40% of the gamers are kind of losers. You know what I mean? Not me, though. I'm a cool gamer. I'm the coolest gamer hence why i've got 69 in my gamer tag cool 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 but she is like implying that men are you know different in terms of how we treat people no bro we'll treat a man we'll call a man a fat ugly cunt we'll call a woman a fat ugly cunt if we're playing call of duty or whatever just a bit of bants there's no need to take it personally and they feel left out who cares that's life life is shit how you could possibly find it fun 
to make other people feel unsafe. Just to comment on that, you should never feel unsafe. But if you're, you know, someone's talking to you o over the line, you know, via headset in a different country and you feel unsafe, that is on you. You know what I mean? Don't get me wrong. People can say nasty things and stuff like that, but that's on you. A woman is asking men to make gaming a safe space with sunshine and rainbows and everything. But could you please be normal? Because I want to be able to enjoy playing the game without my life being threatened, without my body being threatened, because I'm existing as a woman. And men are the ones making it unsafe. Again, unsafe. I don't like this word. Uh, you know, when when someone says something online, uh, it's usually just all talk. No, you know, no backbone. When they say, ah, get back in the kitchen. They're not going to come to your house, put a collar on you and say, get in the fucking kitchen. That's not how it's going to go. All they're saying is just implying a joke, you know what I mean? If you're a bad gamer woman as well, you're going to get your sh absolutely annihilated, you know what I mean? You are going to be rinsed like a dish after you've just had your supper because you are getting rinsed, my friend. Not only are you a woman, which gamers, most gamers don't like, maybe they're closeted, you know what I mean? I'm just saying, Tom Cruise, I'm never coming out. Or maybe they're just having a bit of banter. Just a joke, mate, you know what I mean? If it was in a lobby of men and a lobby of women, I think they'd be treated the same. I don't think you should joke about raping people, things like that, obviously, because you don't know someone's story the same way you wouldn't joke oh, i'm gonna fucking stab you and your nan it's like well what about if someone actually did you know their nan's dead or something you would rather not bring it up it's the same with rape you, you know you shouldn't say shit like that i get that but getting back in the kitchen is just a fucking joke if you if you're seriously going to get triggered by that well there, there's there's a problem if you feel targeted by me saying men or if you feel attacked by me saying men you are part of the problem if you feel attacked by that you're part of the problem if you say just mute them you're part of the problem. I'm part of the problem. I'm part of the problem. I, I think muting is the solution. You know what I mean? It's as simple. The same way when I used to play Counter Strike, like I used to play a lot with my mates. You'd always get them idiots. You know, they'd usually be like, Corva, Sogoblet. They'd be screaming down the mic and they'd have, you know, you could hear everything that was going on in their house. Their dog barking, the little kid crying in the corner, the mum beating the shit out of the dad. You could hear it all. You just click mute. It's three seconds, if that. You know what I mean? Three seconds if you decide to itch your nose during it. It doesn't take a long time. If you sit there and let them say that, me and you don't intervene you are part of the problem because i have a lot of male friends normal male friends who don't say slurs and don't threaten people and just play like normal i understand it it's not all men but if you are not one of the men doing this it is entirely on you to help stop the men who are see she's just insulting men you know what i mean saying oh men are the problem and it's not all men yeah okay but then now she wants our help to sort of unite as the avengers and come and save a day like i'm not batman you know what i mean stand on your own two feet bro you are a strong independent woman who uh, can do stuff yourself you don't need me don't don't tell her to get back in the kitchen you you cretin it's like what 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 are you on about it's a, it's a bit of banter bruv like it's not serious get in the fucking kitchen and make me a toaster you know what i mean you're not on it like that and to say oh you're part of the problem if you don't no you're not you know what i mean you know it's like people say well who do you support israel or palestine i don't support fucking any of them war war is bad you know what i mean it doesn't matter what side of the fence you sit on or who do you support ukraine or russia neither you know what i mean war is complicated and there's things we don't know as people and then to say oh, if you sit on the sidelines and just listen and have a giggle you're part of the problem nah bro no i'm not if you don't understand that and you don't understand power imbalances and gender hierarchy it's not my place to teach you. I'm not your mother. I'm not your teacher. Close the game. I'm not your mother. I'm not your teacher. But I've just lectured you for two minutes. Okay, sweetheart. Whatever you say. Oh, sorry. I shouldn't say sweetheart. She'll um, she'll say I'm a pe patronizing pig or something. Now, this is stemmed from this video here. Now, this video is bad. I, I do want to say that. You are literally just fucking all talk, bro. Oh, be honest with me. So she, you know, she's giving it your old talk, bro. This, that, and the other. A sip of coffee. Oh, it's very cold, that. Do you know what rape feels like? Oh, why does it look like shit? Sorry, boys. Hold on. Literally just fucking all talk, bro. Oh, be honest with me. One down. My ult's ready. Do you know what rape? No, I don't actually. Well, do you want to know? Are you saying you're going to rape me? Because you're heading on the right path right now. Are you saying you're going to rape me? You're going on the right path right Is that what you're saying? Toxins going up. It's not rape if I like it. Now, obviously, that was pretty terrible. Is it now? And, yeah, probably not... Well, you shouldn't say it. And, you know, I can't understand a woman, how she feels. It's obviously a very traumatic thing people go through. She might have gone through it herself and obviously didn't want to admit that or knows people. But did you need to quit? You know what I mean? Like, there's a there's a mute button, you know? Like, you know? Like, th there is a mute button. I'm, I know that is, this, that, and the other. It's like, well, it's not right before I like it. It's like, well, he's obviously... I don't think he means that. Uh, 
But I understand why you quit. You didn't feel comfortable. I think maybe you just mute him slightly. Now, I just wanted to comment on this because I think this guy's the biggest idiot in gaming. Um, so he obviously has a girlfriend who was very pretty and unsurprising to her, uh, you know, unsurprisingly to anyone, he's they've broken up. She was only riding his PP for the view views and she's got her view views and now she's left him in the dustbin outside the back of her house. Don't give a fuck, bro. I'm not one v one of you. Sure. Play the fucking game. Yes. You're so washed, and you fucking wifed up a thought. Okay. Oh. No. Damn. Yo, yo, yo. Oh, oh man. man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Man. No, no, no. I, I'm sorry. Oh, apologize like I'm a good sorry. bitch. <laughs> apologize like a good bitch. I like that. Apologize like a good bitch. I like that. Yeah, yeah, my bad. Hey, I'll hey, my bad. I'll hey, one v one for ten thousand. I'll one v one for ten thousand. Oh. We love you. Ten thousand. Oh. Bro, you don't want to lose ten thousand. Oh, do you have ten bands? You have 10 bands? See, money's changed this fella. He was not like that when he started and was streaming to one person. You got 10 bands, bro? You got 10 bands? Piece of shit. Fucking no. Exactly! Shut your bitch ass up! Sorry, it's not about bread, bro. Like... See, someone's very clearly got a sensitive side when it comes to his girlfriend because everyone takes the piss out of him because everyone knew and could see for a fact that she was, you know, using him. And it actually happened and he got rage mad. Man got angry. But yeah, they split up. Rest in peace. Who cares? <laughs> Just so you know, I don't even know anymore. Boys were in a breakup. Girls in a breakup. Night flights equals day flights. She don't give a fuck, bro. She's so done. Anyway, guys, that's going to be my uh, video. What do you guys think? I feel bad for male ga gamers, but also it's part of the game. If you're a male, if you're a female, if you're not a gender, you got to give it, you got to take it. It's just part of gaming, bro. Go to a football match. Tell me how you feel being screamed at by fans from all over the world. That'll make you feel a lot worse. Anyway, guys, thank you. Goodbye.